guys, welcome to Planning with Crystal. Today's unboxing is the latest Space NK goodie bag gift with purchase. This one is the Makeup Summer Club gift. That's what they were calling it. So this one I had to spend £85 on makeup and the gift is worth over £165. I was actually quite excited by this gift. So unfortunately, as it turned out, it was a UK only gift and it didn't say that on my email. I had to go delving into the terms and conditions to find that. So I wasn't aware of that at first. Um, but she's kind of a shame really and I'm not oh I think I know why actually though I think I've worked out why I was gonna say I'm not sure why but I know why I, I do know um oh, I think I do it's got perfume in so I'm gonna assume that is the reason why they don't want to ship it out of the UK um because they use I think Royal Mail well they certainly do in the UK Royal Mail will not ship perfume outside of the UK it's not really an excuse they could have absolutely done this for other countries I'm sure but that is what this particular gift was. Surprisingly, it went on sale on the Monday and I think it was live or should have been live until the Thursday and it sold out so quick within the same day, faster than I expected actually, faster than I've seen for a while. Anyway, in today's um, video, I'm gonna unbox everything. I'm gonna show you everything in here and I'm gonna talk you through what I bought to get the gift. The first thing I bought is the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Set and Refresh Spray. Um, I actually went to the new Sephora at the Trafford Centre the other day. Very nice, big store. I mean, I wouldn't queue for it, but, um, you know, it's a pretty impressive store. And I actually tried this amongst other things I was messing about with, because I buy 99% of beauty online. When I actually do go out and I check out stuff in store, it's really excited to kind of try things and see what they look like in real life. Anyway, I sprayed this. Um, I've kind of... It's been shaken up as I've got it out of the box, because um, usually it's like a two-tone where it's like oil and something else and you kind of mix it together anyway i sprayed this on my hand over some things i'd swatched and i was like whoa this stuff holds everything in place i was like i need to get it so this is the smaller version that they do it's 20 pounds this one for 50 mil i think you can get 100 mil for 35 pound which is obviously better value but i already have loads of setting spray so i don't really need another one so i thought i'm just going to get this one and um see if i prefer it to my charlotte silbury one which i use all the time as well It's also alcohol free, which I appreciate. I do not like spraying alcohol on my face. I find it really drying. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited to give this a try and hope it works as well on my face as it did on my hand, which I will. Um, so yeah, that was the first thing I got. I spent a bit over £85 actually. The next thing I did is I restocked uh, my Drunk Elephant Oobloos Rosy Drops. These are £34 for 30ml or one fluid ounce. I will show you what these look like. Um, I did do a video on these a long time ago and at the time I did the video, it was when they'd just come out and I was like disappointed a little bit with the products because I don't know, I think I expected it to be a little bit more pigmented. I wasn't sure whether I should just mix it in with my moisturiser or whether I should use it as a blush. And I just, I don't know, I just didn't really love it as much as I thought I would. Um, but I've tried it again recently and actually it does layer up if you keep applying it, if you do want to use it as a blush. Um, and obviously now it's kind of fashionable or whatever to have that rosy glow to your skin so if you do want to achieve that kind of look that's what a little drop of it does not a lot really but you can build it up uh, the camera is whiting out a little bit because the lights are on and everything um but it leaves a really kind of subtle rosy hint you can actually see it more probably on my finger there um but you can definitely mix it with products or build it up so i thought i will get back into that for that kind of natural makeup look um which is what i tend to go for rather than anything too out there uh, the next product i got is from aborian and it's their bb cream oh ginseng spf 20 in the shade claire so you might remember if you've been watching me for a while how long i have loved and raved about their cc cream which i still think is brilliant but recently i bought their new concealer which is good although i'm not loving the packaging because i think it looks cheap but that's for another video um but I got some samples from them and I tried this and I was like, I actually might prefer this. So I've realised, they sent me a card actually and it explains about the different CC, BB, etc. creams and the levels of um, like coverage. So the CC cream was kind of one of, the, one of the lighter coverages and the BB cream, uh, sorry, the CC cream was one of the lighter coverages. I then have a different BB cream from them, which is like their heaviest coverage and I find that a little bit too much but the CC sometimes not quite enough. This sits in between the two and is just perfect. So they do this in a smaller size, but I've really enjoyed my sample. I've had about three or four uses out of this sachet. 
and absolutely love it. So I thought, do you know what? I'm going to get the full size because I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of this. It has got the SPF 20 and obviously I'm still going to use an actual SPF underneath as well because that 20 is just not enough. Um, but I have got this on today. I think it just leaves a lovely finish to the skin um, and it's so easy to work with as well. It's not something you like battling to blend or anything. I'll just show you what it looks like. So it goes on... Um, can you even see that? It goes on like that and then it just kind of blends into the skin. I don't even know why I did that because I don't think you can necessarily see it because that's how well it blends. That's how easy it is to use. You could put it on wrong and it would still look right kind of thing. But yeah, they don't have any shades and I think that is because um, most of them will sort of match to other colours. So I just go for the lightest one. It fits to the colour of my skin. Even when I have a little bit of a tan, it still works. Uh, but they do like a couple of others if you're a deeper skin tone than I am. So that is it for the three things I bought to get the gift. I'll just show you the samples I got as well and then we'll go into the gift. One thing I love about Space NK is you can always choose two samples. Most other retailers, if you get a goodie bag, you can't get the samples or you have to spend a certain amount. So I do like that about Space NK. Anyway, I got the Emma Lewisham Skin Reset Face Serum. Let me know if you've used it and what you think. I also got the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream, which I already love. So I like picking up these little sachets to like throw in my bag for like a night away. So I don't have to take a big moisturizer with me, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous moisturizer that leaves a nice kind of glowy look to the skin. Okay, so onto the gift, which I'm assuming you're all here for. Uh, the first product um, I want to mention is actually the perfume because I kind of alluded to that before. And I, th I actually think this is the reason why the gift sold out so quickly. It is by Glossier and it's Glossier U Eau de Parfum and it's in the 8ml travel size. So you can actually buy it in this size. It retails at Space NK for £32. And um, so that's not a bad start for the gift. So obviously Glossier is still a very popular brand and they recently landed at Space NK and this is their perfume. So it's called Glossier U because it's one of those fragrances that will smell different on different people. I know all fragrances smell different on different people, but it kind of adapts to your skin and smells really, really different on different people's skin. It is in a rollerball, which is my least favourite way to apply perfume, but there we go. But let me know, if you've tried this, how does it smell on you? Kind of smells a little bit baby powdery on me. It's not my favourite, but on other people, I guess it smells different and they might love it. Uh, next, from RMS Beauty, we've got the Lip to Cheek, just Lip to Cheek, I think it's called, and it's in the shade Beloved. So I've actually got this on my lips today. So it's in a little pot like this. And this is what it looks like. So it's not very big. It's a two gram size we get here. A full size would be 4.82 gram, which is weird as a measurement, um, and that would be £35. This is worth 14 52 price per mil or per gram. Um, and this is what it looks like. So it is just like a balmy kind of texture, but like a dry balm, not like an oily or liquidy balm, if that makes any sense at all. It's quite pigmented. So I have got this on my lips and then I've just put a little bit of clear lip balm over the top just to give it a glossy look. But it basically gave me a kind of muted red lip. So if you wanted you know, like the traditional way you would probably do is put a normal red lipstick on and just kind of try and blur it out, maybe blot it a bit. This did this instantly without any effort, so that was good. Next, from Laura Mercier, we have got the Translucent Setting Powder in the shade Translucent in a two gram size. This is actually what um, I'm wearing on my face to do. It's one of the powders I reach for quite a lot. The Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder, it's been around for a very long time. I think I was using this like 20 years ago. Um, and it's, it's still going strong because it's a very, very good formulation. It's one of those, you put it on and, you know, you've got a lot of control over it. It doesn't give you a powdery finish. It lasts all day and it's, it's really good. Um, so that hasn't got much of a value. A full size would be 29 gram for 38.50, making this worth 265. So a very low value um, price wise, but because you don't need much powder, I could probably, it'll probably last me a month or two in that size, but again, good for travel, etc. Next from Westman Atelier, we've got the Petite Baby Cheeks Blush Stick, 2.5 gram in the shade Petal. So this is actually a travel size. So you can buy it in this size as a travel size on the Cult Beauty website. I've got everything linked underneath, by the way, if you want to check it out, um, for £23. For some reason, Space NK don't sell the travel size version, but they include it in their gift. So if you twist it up, that is how much product is in there. And it is just a kind of blush type product. There it is here. And that was the RMS product. So two very different colours, really. That seems a lot creamier 
than the RMS products. Um, I probably prefer the packaging on this one as well because it'll just be a lot easier to apply it where I want it to go and blend it out than it will be to kind of stick my fingers in like the RMS Beauty one which has now stained my finger. So until I get some makeup remover on it, it's just gonna stay like that. Next from Milk Makeup, similar type of product, we have got the Matte Bronzer Baked Bronze Cream Bronzer and Contour Stick in a sample size. So this one is actually three gram. A full size would be six gram and 22 pound, making this worth 11 pounds price per gram. This is what the packaging looks like. It is just a kind of thin plastic and this is how much product you got. A lot less, well, I was gonna say it's a lot less than you get in the Westman Atelier, but it can't be because it's 2.5 gram and the Westman Atelier was three grams. So logically, this must be slightly bigger. I am not a bronze, 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 bronzer fan, um, just because I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. So rather than make an absolute mess of it, I'm just not even gonna try. Uh, next from Revitalash, we've got the Revitalash Advanced. This I use all the time. Uh, how many times have I spoken about this product as well? So this is a sample size, which is 0 0.75 mil. So it's three quarters of a mil, not a very big size, but then a full size, you can either get a two or a 3.5 gram one. And it's a very pricey product. So that's what I would kind of expect to see for a sample. So two mil of the product, which is like a full size, is 99 pounds, making this size worth price per mil 37.12. Now, my thoughts on this, you are not gonna get results from just using this sample. I wouldn't have thought, when I did it anyway, it took about eight to 12 weeks to really see the results. Now I still use it and I know my lashes have grown because you know yourself anyway, don't you? Just looking at them. I mean, I've got no mascara or anything on today. Maybe maybe I should have done. Um, I do still have another lash lift actually. So they're right at the end of that and it's just my own lashes left to fend for themselves. But basically this has made my lashes so much longer. They hardly ever fall out. They're just, I absolutely love it. So I don't think I'll ever stop using it. I think it's brilliant. I think it's very expensive. It really is, but it, it really works. So it's actually worth it. So I think, like I said, I don't think this is necessarily gonna give you results just from this one size of product. I think you'll probably run out before you see the results, but it will maybe give you a chance to use it, see how the formula feels for you. Cause they do have one for sensitive eyes if this is in any way irritating. I'm not particularly irritated by it, and I do have sensitive eyes, but it might be a consideration. And also, are you actually gonna get into that routine where you are putting this on every night? Because if you're not, it's not gonna work. You basically have a little thin brush. I should have grabbed mine out of the bedroom, but I didn't. Um, and you just basically put it on almost like you would eyeliner just above the lash line, and that's it. Go to sleep, just do it every single night. You will definitely notice a difference, like I said, in eight to 12 weeks. Next, from Nailberry, we have got one of their Nail varnishes, this is in the shade Candy Floss. This just looks like the perfect everyday nail color. The, just my nails look super healthy and glossy. Um, like another one, another product that you just can't mess up because it's just a really nice, easy color. I don't really buy much nail varnish anymore because I tend to um, have gel nails, but when I did buy nail varnish, I got nail berry and I've got quite a few of them and their formulation is just brilliant really good quality they're really careful about the ingredients and things they use a great brand this is a full size 15 mil and it retails for 16.50 but just i looked at it and i thought that is just a perfect shade for when you just want to put something on and it's super easy and you don't need to think about it too much next from vive the skin nova instant radiance primer we see this one a lot it's in the five mil size so this is the um little primer they do, obviously in a sample size. I personally find this a little bit too glossy for my skin. It's not my preferred primer, but many people absolutely love it. A full size would be 30 mil for 29 pounds, making this size worth 4.83 price per mil. Next from It Cosmetics, we have got Confidence in a Cream, the Transforming Moisturizing Super Cream, Anti-Aging Armor. So this one is in a seven mil size. A full size it would be 60 mil for 45 pound, making this worth 525. It is a really nice moisturizer. Nicely moisturizing moisturizer. This one smells a little bit like baby powder as well. It's obviously the theme of the day. Then we have got a mascara from Hourglass. It's their Caution Mascara. This is actually smaller than um, some of the ones they include in the gifts. Sometimes in the gifts you will get the travel size. This is not the travel size. This is very much a sample. So this one in a full size would retail for 
Um, £31 for 9.4ml of product. This particular mascara is 3.8 gram, making this worth £12.53. So still a decent value, but it is a very small mascara. It's very cute though. Although, even though I'm saying it's small, the next mascara, which incidentally comes in a bigger box, um, is actually at 3 uh, mil as well, or 3 gram. So um, this is the Ilia Mascara. This one is another pretty well-known one, the Limitless Mascara. This one's actually classed as a travel size, so maybe I've been unfair to Hourglass. Um, so for this brand, this is their travel size, 3 gram, and it retails for £14. It's in the shade After Midnight, which I'm going to guess is black, um, but I like the name. And this is what the packaging looks like on that one. And then from Borean, we have got the Skin Hero Glow, non-tinted, perfect, smooths and brightens, transformation in a 5ml or 0.8ml size. So um, they do a lot of skincare type products. In fact, the Borean products, even the BB and CC creams, have got skincare properties in them. This one is more like a primer, but you don't have to use it as a primer. You can just kind of put it on to make your skin look nicer and brighter. And it has got things like glycerin and niacinamide in there. So it's going to do some actual brightening as well as giving you that sort of nice finish to your skin there and then. It will over time make your skin better. And that's what Arborean are all about. So this is what it looks like when you put it on your skin. It just kind of leaves you with a nice finish. So if you just literally don't want to put makeup on, you just want to put a nice something on to make your skin look better, this might be it. The final product in this set is by Rare Beauty and it's the Soft Pinch Dewy Liquid Blush in the shade Hope. This is again very much a sample size. Although if you've used the blushes from Rare Beauty before, they seem to last forever. Like the big ones, I've never once replaced one because they're just massive. This is very, very small for them. Um, it's like almost too small to open. It's got a little brush like that. Just put a little bit on. I know I'm looking to the right, that's where the screen is on this camera. So um, <laughs> look how pigmented that is for like two drops. It's crazy. So I'm doing very well. So I might be making an absolute pig's ear of it. Very tiny, but very, very pigmented. This is 1.43 mil, and based on the price of full a full size, it is worth 4.19. So it is not a big value, but how handy is that for travelling with? And it is a pretty colour and a very nice blusher. If you've never used their blushes before you're in for a little bit of a treat. So that was the unboxing. As usual, everything will be linked in the description box, along with a whole bunch of discount codes if you want to do a little bit of beauty shopping and you want to save a little bit of money. Uh, some of the links are affiliated, which means I might get a small commission if you do purchase anything using the links. And I do really appreciate all of your support. It helps me to make videos like this. So I really hope you've enjoyed watching the video. I'd love it if you give it a thumbs up, let us know you're enjoying the content I'm producing. And I'd love it if you subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you'll be notified when my next video goes live. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.